Download the All-Star app. Make your picks for UFC fights, challenge your friends, level up and win prizes. Link in description. Get it now. Let's talk about, um, what's her name? Um, Pejita. She's like, she's the interim Adam White kickboxing world champion. Now she just beat Anissa Mexen. So Mexen's, she was considered like probably one of the greatest of all time. Yeah. And Pejita, how old is Pejita? Let me see. 22, if I'm not she's wrong. Only, yeah, she's, she's only 21. Two. She's 21. Mm-hmm. And she just beat Anissa many, yeah, yeah, in her prime too. Yes. Anissa Mexen is in her prime. Uh, what did you think? What did you think of that? No, I was hoping her to win. I really was hoping that, and I think it's a big thing for her, you know. And um, I think in when she was fighting at Thai fight, she didn't really get enough like uh, like eyes on her. I think she deserved a lot more eyes, and uh, yeah. And now I'm happy that she's fighting for one, and that she will she won the championship too. So it's like yeah, now everyone knows who she is, and I think she deserves to be out there. Yeah. yeah. I've seen her fight a couple of times. I interviewed her a few times. Oh, her, really? You know I mean? Yeah, because oh. when she started with the uh, one, that's yeah. when I saw her, was going to the shows oh, and stuff, right? So, yeah. so um, yeah, like watching her fight, I didn't really know much about her until like she just yeah. came on the scene recently. And then watching her, I was just like, man, this girl, she can be like yes. the biggest star. Like, yes, for and them. yeah, and she's been fighting like a good names when she also yeah. was in Thai fight, like. I was the same like I had no idea about her and then she started beating big names you know and that she fought one of my old teammates too and then I started to really like oh like she is good and the upcoming star you know definitely and she yeah. was fighting the boys yeah she has a good story but she was yeah, fighting she boys had, yeah yeah huh she was fighting boys yeah what yeah, yeah she, she didn't have anyone to fight and yeah. then she was just she was fighting, fighting boys, boys. yeah, yeah. What a fucking weapon. Yeah. yeah, like since like 10 years old. Yeah. And uh, her style, though, I think, just from me watching her last couple of fights, her style is like really good for kickboxing. Yeah. Because yeah, her yeah, hands are really good. She can knock you out with her mm-hmm. hands. I'm going to have to go back and rewatch it. I didn't see that fight because I fell it's asleep. Really good fights. I, I fell asleep fell after. Asleep. <laughs> yeah, I fell asleep after uh, Nico Carrillo's fight. And then I woke up and watched Tao and Chai and just didn't go back and watch any others. Okay. Me- Mexen, she she hasn't fought in a long time, so maybe you could yeah. say that she had some ring rust or whatnot. But how much fight? How many fights has she had? Like Mexen? a yeah, like a lot. Yes. Like, exactly. like hundreds. Like hundred yeah. fights. Yeah, I don't yeah. think you lose it if you've had like over a hundred yeah. fights. So well, yeah, but, but they might do a rematch. So yeah, I think they're gonna do a rematch because I was reading the comments after, and everyone's were like, "Oh, Anissa lost only because she hasn't fought in a long time," mm. which like kind of is true because. Like the Thai has been very active, but uh, I I still think like I don't know. Like Anissa has been asking for a title shot for so long, and all of that. Is... Yeah. Everybody has an excuse. Well, you know, yeah. there's an excuse for everything. Yeah, exactly. You know I mean, you yeah. could be you could you could have done like a three month camp. Yeah, and for just a fight, yeah. And then there will always going to be an excuse. Yeah, yeah. Right? You're, always, so, you're always going to have an excuse. Exactly. Yeah. And yeah. this is fighting. There's no, yeah. no one's. Yeah, it's nothing like fighting. Is, yeah, yes. Nothing's 100%. Yeah, nothing's you know I mean? promised. And nothing is what you see on the outside either. Yeah. Yeah, that's yeah. fighting too, you know? So, um, but yeah, I think, um, man, it's cool to see that her like yeah, rise to that and like end the year yes. as the champion now. Yeah. And then she could fight. I think she's going to fight Janet Todd. Yeah, probably. Janet Todd's which Janet Todd hasn't fought in like three years or something like that, which is crazy. No, too. didn't she fought Alicia just yet? Yeah, but then uh, kickboxing, kickboxing, yeah, 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 yeah. For kickboxing, yeah, yeah. So, uh, Pechi just she's gonna. I think she's gonna. She could actually go to boxing in too, which yeah. is good for her. Didn't she do boxing? Yeah, yeah, yeah I think she, she went did, to like yeah. national team or something. Yeah, like that. that's what I thought. Yeah. yeah, she's done a lot of shit for yeah. being twenty-one yes, years old. Yes, yes, mm-hmm. I listened to her story too. Yeah, yeah. I was surprised. All these girls, you know what I mean? Like they. They be through a lot of shit. Like a lot of the girls yeah. fight the boys, you know, I mean? yeah. stuff like that. So, um, but it's like, what's next for her though? Do you follow the the one championship? Yeah, I follow one championship a fair bit. You do? I, I mostly focus on the guys. So if I'm being honest, you don't you don't care about Pejita? Not really. <laughs> Not really. Yeah. <laughs> if I'm being honest, with you, I'm just like Carolina talk. <laughs> yeah. It was no. just like you're just hoping I don't. <laughs> no, nah, to be honest, I don't really watch. Like, sounds like I should watch her because I don't really watch. You have women's to watch fights. Her. Yeah, like, you have to watch. watch that. It's a super good fight to learn too. Mm-hmm. You know, it's like uh, 
start like fight to study because mm. like the way she moves and like counters and throws things is is pretty nice. Mm. Yeah.